Hi guys. Okay, so this video is going to be a massive haul video. It's probably going to be like 20 minutes long and I'm sure it's going to be this long, but this is definitely going to be my last haul video for another, you know, a long time. So the first thing I'm going to start off with is my Mac stuff. Um, I placed an order there about a month ago and I also, me and the husband were in Alberta, so we went to the West Edmonton Mall and, you know, went to the Mac store and picked up some stuff. I filled a Z billet with all my Kai shadows. Um, I'm not going to tell you all the names because it's just going to take way too long. Uh, but I can post every single one of them in the description box below. So I got that here. I'm sorry if you can hear some, you know, youngsters yelling in the background. Today's my daughter's birthday. She turned six years old today, so she got, you know, a friend over and, you know, that kind of stuff. We're heading out to go swimming and all that great stuff soon. So, yay! I also picked up two new brushes. I got the MAC 130 brush, you know, just a stippling brush. I heard that that's really good for the moisture cover. I think this was called foundation. I also got another um, 239 brush. Yes. So I picked up some lipsticks and this is my first one. I'm going to show you. I've been wearing this a lot lately and it's called, oh, it's called Dark Side. Um, in my video I've been calling it Lady Danger but it's called Dark Side and I'll give you a swatch over there um, you know it's a beautiful purpley red kind of color I absolutely love it I love it so much Rebel I'll also give you a swatch there so that's Re Dark Side and that's Rebel there it's Rebel's a lot more pink toned than Dark Side and the last lipstick I'm going to show you is Cyber, which is a really dark, beautiful purple color. So that's Cyber there. The next thing that I picked up is the Mineralized Concealer. And I got this one in NC15. Uh, Let's Makeup uses this pretty frequently. And apparently it's really good for underneath the eyes because there's so much moisture in this. So I picked up that here, Pro Longwear Lip Glass. And this one is in Dark As Night. I don't know if you're gonna see that, but I'll also do a swatch on my hands. I love this. I also picked up two uh, lip liners. I picked up Current, which Current and um, Dark Side is my two favorite combos. So that's the Current lip liner there. The other lip liner I got is Night Moth. And that's that lip liner here. This Night Moth, right there. So that is the product series that I got from MAC. I'm also going to be showing you the stuff that I got from Sephora. Um, I gotta take all this stuff out first. So I picked up the Kat Von D uh, foundation. I'm after using this a good few times. This foundation is so full coverage like this is a full-on foundation it lasts for an amazing amount of time the color ranges are not the greatest um this is i'm pretty sure this is the lightest in um the pink undertone uh foundation and it's a little bit off for my skin but i mixed it in with my moisture cover and a bit of moisture no i mix it in with my um mineralized moisture foundation by mac because uh, this like this completely covers my freckles. It's called Lock It Tattoo Foundation. So I'm pretty sure you can cover tattoos with this. But this foundation is, it is beautiful. It's mousse like, it's not heavy, it's not cakey. It goes on beautifully. The only problem is, you know, it's not the greatest when it comes to the actual colors themselves. I also picked up a new set of lash colors. I got two OCC lip tires. I picked up, um, I don't see the name on this one here. Um, black. I can't. I can't see the other word. But it's a really, really, really dark purple color. And I also got this one here. Hopefully, I'll be able to see the name on this one. This one is called Vintage. So these are the two OCC lip tires that I picked up here. And the other thing, another thing that I got is the Nars. Um, the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. Um, yes, yeah, so 
that's what that one looks like there and this is in the color um, vanilla is light number two I picked up two more Anastasia products. I got the Brow Wiz, <laughs> and this one is in soft brown uh, for when I, you know, wanna do a more natural kind of eyebrow. So I picked up that one there. And I also picked up the, the brow gel, the tinted brow gel, and this is in the color um, Grante, I think. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. More than likely, I'm not. <laughs> And I also picked up a bunch of Kat Von D lipsticks, so just give me a minute I get them out of the box here. So I picked up five of them and oh this colour is really nice. I didn't have you know a great amount of time to play with these but this one is called um, Home Girl and it's that colour there. This is a beautiful beautiful, beautiful colour. Um, this one here is called Prayer. This one of my another one of my favourites at the moment. Uh, this one is called Hellbent, which is you know your beautiful like blue base red type colour. This one here is another one of my favourites. It's called Lovecraft. Oh beautiful pink colour. And I noticed my uh, camera is not doing these colours any justice. And this one is called uh, Cathedral. Oh, it's a beautiful colour, so they're the five uh, lipsticks that I picked up by Kat Von D. And the last thing I want to show you by um, Sephora is my favorite like face duo product at the moment. And it's from Dior. It's um, Dior Nude 10. And I got the lightest one. And it comes with a really cute one. I just completely freaked out. <laughs> freaked out. It comes with a really cute, you know, small kabuki brush. And it comes in like this velvet packaging, uh, well, cover I should say, it's like slip. This is what it looks like, so friggin' pretty. And this is what it looks like. Beautiful, 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 beautiful product. I absolutely love this. I picked up two new hair dyes, because uh, the blue and the purple, it's not really the manic panic, it's not working out for me. So I picked up the Pr Pravana. I got the purple and the green. So that's the colours that my hair are going next. When we were in Alberta, I got stopped by a girl uh, that worked at Oral Gold. I'm pretty sure she's the manager or the owner or something like that in here. And um, so yeah, I picked up this. It's a face exfoliant and you're only supposed to use it once a week because it, it removes every single bit of the you know dead skin and that kind of stuff off your face. And all those little particles on the inside of it is actually 24 karat gold. And it is, the stuff works. Um, when I used it, there was like, it's gonna sound gross, but there was like chunks of skin. Not like chunks coming off the face, but it all, you know, beaded up and I could actually see like all the dead skin coming off my face. You know, so gross, so amazing at the same time because afterwards it felt incredible. I also got like a massive uh, manicure set, but I gave that to my, um, my mom. She gave me a bunch of samples of the uh, the body butter, which the manicure set actually came with the body butter. And she also gave me a sample, and this is paraben free, of the um, it's the daytime and nighttime moisturizer. Which these um, samples are actually pretty big. I wasn't even planning on going in there. I didn't even know what the company was, what the products was, no, not like that. But uh, yeah, the girl came out and stopped me and, you know, she suckered me in pretty much. I went to Sally's and I got um, some nail polishes. They were on clearance. This one by China Glaze is called Avalanche. Uh, it's a beautiful um, metallic grey with a purple undertone. I got this glitter here and this one is called Scattered and Tattered. Um, by China Glaze. This one by China Glaze is called Recycle, which is just, you know, a matte gray. And then this one, I don't even know what this brand is, but it's called Art of Theft, and their Finger Paints is the name of the nail polish. It's one of those, um, like, chameleon type of nail polishes, so I got those there. I also went to my local drugstore and I picked up a couple of products. 
and one of the first things that I got is the Skinny Jeans uh, Benefit Creaseless Eye Cream. These are amazing and this colour is out of bounds. Um, let's make up if you're watching this. I suggest that you get this. This is the colour I can see you totally working with. It's this beautiful like muted gold, beige, grey. Oh, it's just... It's a beautiful, 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 beautiful product. I love it. I don't even know if my camera is focusing in on it. There we go. It's so amazing. And when I saw this, I thought of focus. When I saw this, I thought of let's make up right away. 24 seven, uh, like felt tip liner, waterproof liners. Um, I'm not going to swatch these because my hands kind of blacked up now and uh, but uh, Vintage Rataki put up a massive video on uh, the Urban Decay liners and I'm pretty sure the ones that I'm going to show you is in it so I'll put the link to that in the description bar below. I also picked up the Glide On uh, pencil in Lotus. I will swatch this. It's a beautiful green colour which actually would have went perfect with the eyeshadow look that I got on today which more than likely I'll probably end up incorporating this into my everyday makeup look. I also got um, Freak and it's that metallic -y, bright beautiful coloured hair. So yeah they're the liner set I got. So the last bit of cosmetic stuff I'm going to show you is um, sugar pill. I bought the rest of their line. I finally got their bulletproof um, black eyeshadow. So I picked that up there. Four of their um, packs of three uh, pigments. So I picked up all those. And then in the single ones I got Tipsy, which is a beautiful green color. I hope my camera is picking up on it. Um, this one is called Paper Doll beautiful light kind of purple colour. I also got Asylum which is a beautiful uh, red colour. I also got Magpie which is another favourite colour of mine. And the last pigment that I got is Weekender which is another favourite pigment of mine. I'm telling you Sugar Pill is insane and they just uh, launched more products from their line which I know I said I'm not going to be buying anything else but I'm definitely going to have to pick up more sugar pill. Sugar pill, I'm telling you, is flowing through my veins. I absolutely love sugar pill. That is the end of uh, the cosmetic side of me haul video. Okay, so when I was trying to record the uh, closing part of this haul video, my memory card got full and then I had to rush out because we were taking the girls swimming and today's her birthday and then uh, we were taking her out to supper and the baseball game so here it is, like six hours later, makeup still in tech, so I decided to finish uh, my haul video. So the shirts I'm going to be showing you now, I got them from, actually I got all the stuff up in Alberta, but here's one of the shirts here, gorgeous shirt. It's one of those shirts that are, you know, shorter in front but longer in the back, and, but I have to wear like a tank top underneath mine, because I'm a bit, you know, on a chubbier side, but that's how the back of it goes. You know, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful shirt. This is another one of the shirts that I got. This is my favourite one because I'm obsessed with Geisha girls. But that is what that one looks like here. It's um, one of those, you know, really shredded crop tops. It look really nice with, you know, just a bra underneath it. And both of the sides there um, tie up. Love this shirt. I'm after wearing uh, the both of them a couple of times already. So I'll get two of those there. Silent Angels. So that's the name brand, I'm pretty sure, Silent Angels, and that's both shirts. I'm pretty sure those shirts are done by um, tattoo artists that teamed up with designers to make clothing type of thing. I stopped into Simon's, I'm pretty sure that's the name of the place, and those shirts, both of them were $39.99 each. This shirt here was $58 and I got it at Simon's. It's um, another one of those, um, it's a sweater but it's longer. In the back than it is in the front, so that's how it goes down there like that. Um, the colour in it, it is uh, black, but it has gold going through it. And of course it has the studded sleeves. I love this sweater so much. This looks so nice with me. 
black denim and leather leggings. So I got that sweater here. And then I stopped into uh, Seductions. And both of these shirts that I'm going to show you was only $15 each. These uh, would be really lovely for a pair of leggings as well. Um, I got a white one and a black one just like it. It's like a, a shirt dress type thing. Of course, again, it's longer in the back than it is in the front. And, you know, it's a strap shirt. And it got a big cross there. And I got the black one that's, you know, identical to it. Just the difference is that it's black. Like I said, it's like... It's a dress, so it's longer in the front than it is in the back. So yeah, I got two of those there. I also filled two bags full of Lush products, but I'm not going to be showing you that stuff because I think these video, this video is long enough as it is. And I don't know if you could tell, but I got burned today. I had my shoulders exposed for about, I don't know, five minutes. And I got, you know, pretty badly burnt. Shocking. I'm froze to death now. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, that's my haul video. Um, from stuff I was actually picking up and then, you know, from my vacation haul. So I just decided to throw it all in together. So I'm finally caught up now with all the products and stuff that I bought. Um, I'm pretty sure there's nothing else that I need to show you. I'm pretty sure that's everything now. Show you. Oh, I forgot one item. I picked up one skirt and this skirt was $27 and this is a large. Oh, the shirts were a large and my sweater is an extra large. I like my shirts tight fitting, but I love my sweaters really baggy on me. Um, and this skirt is a large. So this is what it looks like. Little skull decal. I think it's so cute. Little skull studs. Um, this is very sheer, but then, you know, it has the thicker cotton kind of feeling underneath. And it's nice and stretchy, so... Yeah, I love, love, love this. So I hope you like this video, guys. And until my next one, I'll see you all soon. Bye.